So when you go inwards and you come to this me, this I, and you're questioning it, what happens after that? Does it become quiet? Does it become empty? Do you go in a deeper meditation? Does your mind get more activated or it becomes quiet? What happens? I, I see the I now, but, and not the emptiness, just the I. Okay. Is this I a thought, or it's real? It's uh, real. Okay. So, what can it, what can happen to it? when the body dies, where would it go? Obviously, there is a mechanism here. There is a being here thinking. There is a being here sensing. And there is concern. There is consciousness. There is an awareness right now. And we call it Monica, is concern about her existence that after this body dies, what happens to me? I, I is still here. Yeah. Yes. You, yes. You are here. Yes. I was uh, six years old, and my grandmother had died, and uh, I was in back of the car, with my parents were driving. I very clearly remember this. I was looking out through the window and it was raining. Raindrops were falling down on a, on a window. And I, I was just wonder, I was just thinking that when the body dies, when I die, where would I go? That thought came for me, and then it was very clear for me that how could I die? How, how could I be no more? How could I not exist? So I asked my parents that when, when somebody dies, what happens? And my parents told me, you, you are no more. You're finished. And I very clearly remember I told my parents, that is not true. That is not true. Because I, I am always here. And I didn't know anything about spiritual teachings or any of these things that I know about now. But it was very, very clear that what could happen to me my existence is here and how could that no longer be when you go deeper inside and you come across the presence of yourself the presence which is here the presence that's always been here and you come in touch with that and some of us can call this meditation, a deep state of meditation. Or we can put any words we want to it. We can attach a word, a description of and explaining this either to ourselves or to somebody else. But those of us who've been together, the core group, of, group that we have been together many times and we've done the work together and we go deep inside and we come and we we go beyond the mind and we arrive in this place 
within ourselves that is just presence is here and it's com completely expanded and it's totally connected and we dive into the place and it's very quiet and it's very still and there is a sense you can call it bliss that's that's a word for it but there is a sense of presence and in that there is a knowing that all is very well and all the fear and doubt they disappear and in those moments that you're in that place well however long that is there is no thoughts or any kind of sense that you can disappear or anything can happen to you everything disappears and those are the moments that you've gone beyond your thinking mind you dive back into your own essence which is pure presence and in those moments that you reconnect to that place it's very clear that you've never been born and you would never die your being your essence before taking the mind before taking a form is eternal it's always here here is the only place there is there is nowhere else outside of here you cannot go anywhere else outside of here the form falls but the witness or the awareness is here it may pick up another form so it can experience third dimension the world of duality and it can experience through the five senses the challenges of life the pleasures of life but you cannot die it's impossible for you to die because for you to die you have to be born there has to be a birth there has to be a time limitation to you to to be born and then you die but if you have never been born how can you die and this birth and death it's simply a fracture of the mind that it appears and it always come with the single word called i there's this sense of me i am separated from the source my eternal being which is always here and in this imagination imaginary i thought comes the sense of time space time gets created and all of a sudden it appears this world appears to it 